Hey everyone, Xanagir here. Spelunky 2 modding has changed quite a bit over the months since I created my original modding tutorial video. I actually created that video when it was in a very, very early state and it changed very soon after that. So I apologize for making this tutorial so late, uh, but I did want to update it so there is a reasonable, good modding tutorial so you can easily download the mods you want to play since there are more and more each day on the site spelunky.fyi. So the first thing you'll want to do is get mod Lunky 2 from spelunky.fyi. Uh, you can see the link is spelunky.fyi slash mods slash overview. Obviously you can just go to spelunky.fyi, click modding and then click modding overview and you want to click downloads uh, and then on here you just want to download the mod Lunky 2 exe um, really really simple and then from there you just want to put the mod Lunky 2 exe in your Spelunky 2 install directory uh, you can get that by going into your Steam install directory or wherever you installed Splunky 2 manually. Uh, the easiest way for most people to do it would probably be to go and click Splunky 2, right click Splunky 2, click manage, and then browse local files. So go ahead and drag mod Lunky 2 into your Splunky 2 install file or install folder. Uh, Windows might try, uh, antivirus in particular, might try to stop this, uh, but no worries. Splunky 2 modding scene is um, fairly trustworthy. Specifically, Mod Lunky is going to be trustworthy as long as you download it from Spelunky.fyi. Uh, obviously, download at your own risk from any other site. Okay, so here you will have your mod lucky 2 user interface uh, lots and lots of options uh, don't get overwhelmed though it's actually very very simple once you get some mods downloaded so from here you want to go back to spelunky.fyi then you go to browse spelunky 2 uh, i'm just going to sort my most downloaded just to get some easy ones uh, let's download Caveman Spelunker. So click the, the page for it. You can click uh, right here to download in Mod Lunky. And there it is. Or uh, an alternate way is to get this install code. Uh, if you ever see someone give you an install code, you just go here on the install mods page and just type in the exact code right there, so it's caveman dash spelunker. That would download this mod. I will actually show you with the penguin cheat. So here, copy it, paste it, install, and it is over on your Play Lunky page. From there, you literally just check the box of the mods you want installed, then click play. Honestly, can't really be much easier than that, uh, but I will make sure it worked. So while opening the game, I realized that this mod actually doesn't install properly. Uh, so I will go ahead and explain why. So with Spelunky 2, all the characters are named after their colors. So I'll open up the texture file and show you. So you'll see that all the characters are black, blue, cerulean, cinnabar. So every character mod has to be named properly one of these colors, uh, char underscore color dot PNG. Um, so this format is actually incorrect. But I'm going to go ahead and rename this to char dot underscore yellow dot PNG. And then once it's saved, I can go ahead and click play. Penguin is also the same thing. It's named char underscore penguin, which is incorrect. Uh, obviously, there's no character in Spelunky 2 named penguin. So we will go ahead and look at it now. 
make sure it worked. Go to Tina, or actually it's Anna, isn't it? Yellow is Anna. Mm -mm. There he is. Okay, there's our little caveman. Um, and uh, character mods, that's uh, the, the instructions I just explained only apply to character mods. Level mods and everything like that should all install properly with no issues. Um, and on top of that, Spelunky, uh, Modlunky 2 also has Overlunky built in, which you can download right here and then launch when your game is open. And you can mess around with all the cheaty stuff that you see in other videos. You can use that to practice various, uh, various things. Um, uh, Splunky 99 is also going to be in Modlunky 2. Whenever it launches to the public, we are hard at work on that. Jeremy uh, had some problems and had to take some development time off, but we'll be getting back to it. And uh, we got a lot of exciting stuff planned for that, uh, as well as the uh, category and pacifist trackers, so you can tell how many uh, if you've killed anyone for pacifist, or uh, which category you're running if you're streaming the game. So that stuff is very, very, very nice, and also is valid for MossRanking.com, so you can submit speedruns there. Uh, let me see if I have anything else I should go over. Uh, da -da 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 -da. I think that should about do it. If you have any questions, make sure you leave a comment below and I will go ahead and pin the most frequently asked questions in the top comment so you can go read that if you have any questions. Also, be sure to read the readme on Modlunky's GitHub if you have any questions as well. Also, I will leave a link in the description for the community Discord, which has a modding channel you can use to ask questions or submit your own mods and talk about mods that are being shared. So I hope you learned a lot from the video and uh, make sure you leave a like and subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Have a good one.